Good evening. This, this question is from Michelle, Michelle Jackson. You stated that you are pro-life. Does that extend to women who have been raped, are victims of incest, or where a mother's life is in danger? Wow, that's a fantastic load of questions. Y'all didn't play around, did you? The mayor pulled the right one, didn't he? I am a pro-life candidate. And I believe that at the end of the day, someone has got to be a voice for their unborn child. I think it's interesting, and I've said this before as well, that the biggest proponents of those for abortion are those who are already hey, alive. Nina is in the library. Can you please come to the adult free. information desk? Which Nina? means they've had their chance and opportunity. Every, and I believe that life begins at conception. Or why do they call the woman pregnant? Every life deserves a voice, and as long as I'm standing and breathing, I'm going to be a voice for the life of the unborn child. Now, somebody asked me a question, and that question is kind of related the same way. But what about in the, in the process of incest or rape or life of the mother? When it comes to life of the mother, that's a hard decision a family needs to make. That's a tough decision. And a husband, a wife, they need to make that decision. It's not my business to make that decision, but I will say for the other two, and I'll be very clear when I say this, and I'll use an illustration and put my, my words behind my heart so you know that I mean it. I believe in the life of the child and an opportunity for that child to have life. I got a phone call, and uh, I, can, I can give this out. I, I got a phone call from a very close family member of ours. She called me and she said, you know how much I care about you. You've been my mentor for years. And I just, I have, I have a very difficult situation. I need your help. And she was crying. And her daughter had been raped. And her daughter had conceived. And she was so angry. And she was so upset. She's from Georgia. I was here in Maryland. And she asked me, she said, would you just please pray for me? All these years I've looked up to you. What should I do? Give me the permission. She was looking for that from me so that she could allow her daughter to abort that child. So I told her, I said, honey, let me and your cousin pray about it, my wife. And I promise you I'll call you, I'll call you tomorrow. Let me pray about it first, give me 24 hours. So that's exactly what we did. We both woke up that morning. We both came to the same realization. We gave the young lady a call that same day, that next day. And here's what we told her. Here's what we'll do. We told her, I need, I told her, I need you to be strong on this one. I need you to trust me. You know I love you. And you know I love your, 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 your daughter. I need you to be strong. Get her through the pregnancy. And my wife and I will take that child and raise her as if that child's our own. We'll take care of that child. We won't ask for a penny from you. In fact, We'll take care of the child, some way start a college fund for that child, even though we have four of our own. And even at some point, when you and your daughter have healed, we will allow you to come get the child anytime you want. No questions asked. We'll find a way to make it work. Life will find a way. We truly believe that. After a week, she called me back. And she said, thank you so much for what you, what you were able to do and what you're able to say to us and your commitment to us. We prayed about it as well. We're going to go ahead and keep the baby. I believe that at the end of the day, life can find a way. And someone can be a voice for that unborn child. But that means that people like you and I, we have to sacrifice. We have to be a community. We have to be a family. We have to extend. And that means sometimes you have to make your life a little bit uncomfortable for someone else. If you stand for something and you believe in it. That might not be everyone's view on this particular issue, but that is mine. Next question.